Darkness has consumed parts of downtown Portland for years. Drug use, crime, and people on the streets hit Ankeny Alley hard. It's just hard to walk through these spaces, and there, it just there's so much darkness. But Erica Litzner and her buddy Elliot Perfect. are helping <laughs> to change that. It just started to feel like there could just be some kind of brightness. Litzner works near Ankeny Alley. I work at Bay's Chicken, which is on Ash between Second and Third. Yes. So. It's just around the corner. <laughs> this week, she and Elliot are busy brightening the alley with Hello's. beautiful big roses are being painted along Ankeny Alley to make the area a little less scary. We can't slap a coat of paint on a housing epidemic, but uh, we certainly can make it pretty for all of us who live here, even the people who sleep here. Litzner thinks these roses will do more than brighten pathway. Offering some kind of beauty is can be a first step to feeling something beautiful. She thinks all Portlanders can agree. I actually just saw somebody walking by here a little bit ago pushing shopping carts and you know I profiled them as unhoused and they seemed stoked. You know they live here too. This one and this one. To make the places where people shop, work, and sleep a little bit brighter. Business owners say they've been losing money almost every month since the pandemic, but they hope Ankeny Alley's summer events change that. The first one kicks off tonight and encourages people to learn the history of the alley by visiting different businesses this weekend. Yeah, hoping the best for all those small mm -hmm. businesses. Thomas, thank you so much.